From the one and only, this is a Local 10 News Update, sponsored by Wellmax Medical Centers. Good evening, everyone. I'm Nicole Perez. And I'm Calvin Hughes, and here's a look at the stories making news on this Monday night. A reaction tonight from a teen tragedy in Pembroke Pines after a student and soccer player was killed in his own home. 15-year-old Achilles Lopez died Saturday night after what police are calling an accidental shooting by a relative. A former coach who has known the teen since he was seven years old is devastated. The Miramar United Elite Soccer Soccer Club also providing grief counselors for Lopez's teammates tonight at the Sunset Lakes Community Center. As of now, charges have yet to be filed for this incident. Only on 10 tonight, a gray a gang spray painting threatening messages on a place where people got to get help, or rather go to get help. This incident happened on Memorial Day weekend, leaving workers afraid. Here's video of the alleged vandals threatening words graffitied on a pregnancy center in Hollywood. The vandalism come as, as the debate over women's rights to an abortion continue. New details about a deadly crash in Hallandale Beach where an 11 year old boy was killed while helping a stranded driver. The boy's father, an Uber driver, stopped to help a driver on Saturday night. The child helped his dad push a Jeep to the side of the road when they were hit by another car. The driver of the Jeep also died. The person who caused this accident is cooperating with police. Traveling through almost the whole world to meet a random guy and he turns out to be one of the best things ever. It's like, how, Aww. what a coincidence. And today we're hearing exclusively from a Ukrainian family who has found a new forever home thanks to a couple from Wilton Manors. Mm. As breaking news happens, we have you covered on air and online. You can always go to our website for more information, local10.com. Be safe out there. See you back on Tuesday.